Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Left, and I'm back here in Destiny to talk to you about a subject that is on everyone's mind, and that is why do Nightfall rewards still have Ascendant materials in them? Um, I did the Nightfall Strike, which is probably the worst one that has ever become into existence. Omnigools, Omnigool, no burns, and I got seven shards. Now, that would be great if I hadn't already had... 132 of them. I honestly would have liked energies because the reward I got from rolling my new monarchy level from the Nightfall was actually better than anything that I have gotten from the Nightfall. Even exotic weapons. Uh, it's the Crusader Scout Rifle from the new monarchy. It's the one I'm currently holding. And its perk roll is honestly... The most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. Currently, it barely has any experience on it, uh, because I haven't used it. I went from the Nightfall to the Weekly to the Raid all in one go yesterday. I'll grab this mission, and then I'll give you guys a look at its perks, and I will do a definite, um, a definite rundown of it. So, Lug in the Chamber, Explosive Rounds, Firefly, you know, it's... Everything fun about the Fatebringer without doing Vault of Glass. So when I get this weapon completely leveled, I'll do a uh, an actual review on it. Not just a, holy crap, look at this. But Bungie, at this point, really needs to take shards out of the loot pool for the Nightfall. Especially the Nightfall that's as bad as Omnigool with no burns. Like, that is honestly, it's harder than hard mode Crota. It is the worst thing I have ever done in my entirety of playing this game. It's worse than no burn Valus Tarek, which is fucking terrible. That strike with no burns is just, ugh. No. It takes forever to kill anything. It's just... It's ridiculously awful. Um, but yeah, an Omnigal with no burns is like is like if they had put Solar Burn on Valus Tarek. Or every burn on the Nexus or something. Just something equally ridiculous to every other strike. There's no way to make energies... A decent reward for doing that. It's honestly... I've never been more disappointed in something that I got... Other than when I got four last words... In the same week. I just... I can't even begin to understand... Why the this was still in the loot drop? Why? Why couldn't I gotten something better? And I I feel like I'm whining a lot about this, but anybody who has done this nightfall understands that this nightfall is just a nightfall is the true test of your metal, especially one with no burns, because you have absolutely nothing giving you any sort of upper hand in any situation whatsoever. Um, it also has light switch, which means uh, if anything gets close enough to you to hit you, which a lot of things do, you are instantly dead. Um, there are stealth melee vandals, there's melee captains, there's thralls everywhere. Everything about it's just bad, and... Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Look at, look at these guys. The only thing that continued to get me through that nightfall was my Yallerhorn, which thank god I have. But if you don't have a Yallerhorn or some kind of just ridiculously overpowered heavy weapon or special weapon, just something that can tear Omnigul a new one really, really quickly... You're screwed. Like, you're just going to be going at it for hours upon hours upon hours and getting nowhere. 
and that's not cool. Like, it's not a lot of fun. And then you're thinking, oh, well, this this Nightfall should have a buffed loot system because of how challenging it is and how much of a test of my true merit as a guardian it is. And then you get shards or energies or slap to the face. I, I still love this game. It's one of my favorite games ever. I just... I don't agree with the loot system a lot of the time. Um, even in hard mode Crota, I have gone through it several times. I've yet to see a, pri a raid primary. I've, I've seen other people get primary weapons literally every time they go through. Um, every time they run through the raid, they'll get something, an Oversoul Edict, a, uh, Abyss Defiant, Word of Crota, Fang of Ir Yut. Like, I almost thought Word of Crota was completely guaranteed, uh, as many people ha who have gotten it, and as few people got the Fatebringer. Like, I thought, with the smart loot system... It was supposed to work. Like, I got all repeat armor. I don't know, the loot pulls for the raid and the nightfall, they need a little bit of work, I believe. Uh, that's my personal opinion. But even, even the packages have sometimes let me down from New Monarchy. But I guess this was Bungie's way of saying, Sorry. We're sorry. But, you know... It's up to them, it's their game, it's all RNG, we can't control it whatsoever. So that is going to do it for me today, guys. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Let me let me know your your uh, your sad tales of the nightfall rewards that you got that were equivalent to energies or whatever. So I will see you guys back here in Destiny.